Today we're diving into the differences between DaVinci Resolve Free and DaVinci Resolve Studio. And I'm gonna make the case for why you should probably look into getting DaVinci Resolve Studio. Let's break it down. But first, if you're looking for music for your videos, look no further than audio. Audio doesn't only have an incredible library of tracks and sound effects, but they have this new feature called Link Match AI. This is where you can grab a link from your favorite YouTube video or your favorite song on Spotify. You can put it into audio and they will match it with the song in their library that sounds very much similar. It's kind of insane. You can sign up for Audio Pro right now if you use my affiliate link and you use code SAVE70 at checkout. And don't forget when you use my link, you're supporting this channel. First off, let's talk about the free version of DaVinci Resolve. There's nothing really wrong with the free version of DaVinci Resolve. You can get a lot done with it. You're just missing out on a bunch of cool features, very pro plugins, and an array of advanced color grading stuff. Just full disclosure here, this is all subjective. Objective? Subjective? This is all a preference thing. For most filmmakers, the free version will be just fine. If you're reaching that threshold where you're kind of seeing you're hitting your limit with the free version, well, it's time to switch to the studio version. Now in comparison, let's talk about DaVinci Resolve Studio. What sets it apart? For starters, DaVinci Resolve Studio opens up the creative field when you're video editing. It unlocks a whole new level of creative possibilities by offering you additional features and plugins. So let's talk about some additional features that DaVinci Resolve Studio has that the free version does not have. So let's talk about the first feature, the transcription feature. This is where DaVinci Resolve goes into your timeline, uses AI to transcribe your whole timeline. When DaVinci Resolve transcribes your timeline, now you can do text-based editing. It's not 100% perfect, but man, is it a time saver. And yes, this feature is only available in the studio version. On that same note, another feature is the automated captions. I use this pretty much on a daily basis for either my own reels or for client reels. Nine times out of 10, when you do the subtitles or captions, they nail it. Every once in a while, I'll have to go in and tweak something, but when I do have to do that, it's super easy to do. Smart Reframe is another one of those AI wizardry tools that DaVinci Resolve Studio offers, and I use it almost on a daily basis. So if you shoot video horizontally and then want to make it into a vertical video, Smart Reframe is your best friend. Simply place your clip on a vertical timeline, you zoom in to fill the whole screen, and then you enable Smart Reframe. A lot of times auto will do the trick, but sometimes you have to be a little bit more precise so you have that functionality with Smart Reframe. So after you've enabled Smart Reframe, Resolve will now keyframe your clip to keep that subject in center. One of the last features that I'll touch on is the noise isolation. This feature is legitimately insane. When filming in a noisy environment, you can either add noise isolation to an individual clip or to the whole audio track and DaVinci will use its AI sorcery or whatever and eliminate the background noise. That is crazy to me. It sounds really, really good. Depending on the scenario, it will either completely eliminate the background noise or you'll hear a little something, but for the most part, it'll make it sound like you're in a controlled environment when it comes to audio. Now look, there are a ton of more features when it comes to the DaVinci Resolve Studio in comparison to the DaVinci Resolve, the free version. And I know I'm only touching on a few and showing you just like little tricks in here and there, but there are features like Magic Mask, where which I'm gonna dedicate a whole video to. The noise reduction in the color tab is kind of one of the big reasons why I even moved to DaVinci Resolve. And the best part about DaVinci Resolve Studio is that you pay one flat fee, that's it. You either pay this one flat fee or you buy a piece of gear and they give it to you for free after buying that piece of gear. There is no subscription required. Adobe. Friendly fire! So in conclusion, yes, you can get a lot done with the free version of DaVinci Resolve, but the tools that you get with the studio version, they're unmatched. They really are unmatched. And I would highly recommend that if you're getting into this video editing world and you're doing great work, you're doing pro work, this will help you get more jobs. This will help you take your video editing to the next level. So I really hope you found this video helpful. DaVinci Resolve Studio is where it's at. Please hit the like button. 
hit the subscribe button if you haven't already, hit the notification bell so that you're notified when I post more videos. We still have a ton to talk about. I'll see you in the next video.